thank you for coming out for this day of remembrance. We want to make this both a sacred and a very special moment. Almighty Father, Creator God, we ask that you would be with us this day, that you would heal our hurting hearts, that you would sear the images in our minds to one of hope. As a nation, we need to be committed to freedom and peace for all. Without forgiveness, we run the risk of fighting evil with evil. However, don't mistake what I am saying because justice does not exclude forgiveness. Freedom does not exclude forgiveness. Peace for all does not exclude forgiveness. Never uh, dreamed that an attack like that was possible. On the 10th anniversary of the World Trade Center attacks, we pay tribute to the over 3,000 people who lost their lives that day. We honor their families. We honor their friends. We honor their memories. While this loss is tragic, it brought to light the spirit of the people of this great nation. It allowed us to see firsthand what are the first responders, that the strength of this country is in its people and in its compassion. We wanted to try to do something like, like all Americans did across the country. They, they take an oath as a firefighter, and it's to help people. It's as simple as that. You're there to help people. Uh, serving and doing what needed to be done. They did not leave uh, that office site uh, for three weeks as they served uh, selflessly at Ground Zero. Salvation Army counselors provided emotional and spiritual support to rescue and recovery personnel working. The Salvation Army provided an American flag for each body removed from Ground Zero. The Salvation Army maintained a 24-hour presence at all three locations during the aftermath in New York City at Ground Zero, in Washington, D.C. at the Pentagon, and in Western Pennsylvania. My name is Mohi Chain, and I'm a board member for the Generation On National Youth Council. Okay. As a board member of Generation On, we run five different projects throughout the year for different days of service, such as the Day of Remembrance. 